Hey viewers, welcome to the best tool review channel on YouTube. To make this video, we analyzed hundreds of products and picked only the best tools for you. Please subscribe to our channel for more guides and check the description box below for product links and updated prices. So let's get started. In this video we going to checking out 5 best clamp meter you can buy right now. We made this list based on tools performance, features, price, manufacturer's reputation and most importantly reviews of actual user. So, if you choose from this list, you can be rest assured that you are buying the best clamp meter in the market. So, let's go for top 5. Our number 1 pick is a Texity MSRC600. This is a great rating, that makes this a good option if you do need to measure higher resistance circuits. There is one major drawback to this device that's hard to overcome. You cannot measure DC with this multimeter. Generally, clamp-on meters are going to be used for standard electric work, so AC should be sufficient for most people. Besides this, our only real complaint is that the screen is not backlit. Let's watch more. Whether you're a DIY enthusiast or a proper professional, our line of multimeters is here to help. All that's left is finding the right one for you. But first, let's take a look at what they all have in common. Each multimeter comes outfitted with a rubber sleeve for greater durability and a stand for hands-free support. You can enjoy safe, reliable performance and the ability to save your results, no matter what multimeter you choose. The MSRR500 is an excellent entry-level multimeter with simple controls and a wide variety of features. It's perfect for any first-time student or amateur hobbyist. If you're looking for something with a little more flexibility and convenience, try out the MSR A600's auto ranging and increased precision. With its clamp design, the MSR C600 offers safe and hassle-free AC current testing while also supporting a variety of other functions. Featuring the most accurate results and greatest number of testing options, the MSR A1000 is the best choice for any electricians or other professionals looking for a new multimeter. We've only begun to scratch the surface, but we hope this helps you find the right tool for the job. Our second best clamp meter is Unity B4Q094UT210E, the Unity mini clamp meter does have some very noticeable drawbacks as well. First, this device has a very difficult time reading DC. It can do it, but you'll have to play around with it and be sure not to move during measuring or it will mess with the current. Worse, the knob is really low quality and doesn't work as we hoped. We had trouble getting it to click into place properly, and sometimes it would zero repeatedly if not fully into a selection. Number 3 in our list is Fluke 324. Fluke is one of the most well-respected names in electrical metering, so it should come as no surprise that their 324 True RMS clamp meter has earned our premium choice recommendation. Of course, it's quite expensive, but the quality is hard to beat. For instance, this device is safety rated for both CAT3 and CAT IV. Granted, you would likely purchase a different meter if you were primarily testing high resistance circuits, but we still would like to have the functionality. Although we have this one minor complaint. Our fourth pick is UA Test Instruments DL369. Mid-range pricing with high-end performance makes the UA Test Instruments DL369 digital clamp on meter our pick for best overall. We always appreciate when a device runs off of common and inexpensive batteries. The UADL369 fits the bill, being powered by two AAA batteries. We were a bit disappointed at the lack of a backlit display though. Electrical boxes are often dark areas to work in, so the extra help to see the screen would have been nice. Last in our list is Metric MK06 clamp meter. This is usually only present in multimeters that are considerably more expensive. Another great feature of this device that we liked was the non-contact voltage detection to tell if a circuit is hot without having to touch it. For working in areas with low light, a flashlight is built in and the screen is backlit. Unfortunately, the backlight is very low contrast and the numbers don't stand out. 
Making matters worse, the screen is recessed which makes it very difficult to see, unless you're at the exact right angle. 